really fortunate because we have one right here. Um, this is the Homosassa Spring. Right underneath that observatory, you can kind of see where the color changes. It goes down about 35 feet and it puts out approximately 2 million gallons of fresh spring water every hour. So this spring flows around the bend to where there is a bridge. If you've walked over that, you possibly have. You probably saw boats um, uh, in the river because that this does flow right into the Homosassa River. The Homosassa River then flows about nine miles out to the Gulf of Mexico. So this is fresh spring water. If you're a fisherman, you're probably looking at the fish and saying, well, what are those fish doing here? Because they're all saltwater fish. Well, they've swum up the nine miles from the Gulf and they hang out here for a week at a time, even though this is fresh water. It's uh, quite incredible. The striped ones that you see are sheep's head. Um, this large, the large ones with the circle by their tail are redfish. Um, the ones that sometimes jump out of the water are mullet. We, um, we've had a tarpon in here. Uh, drum. I mean, it's just amazing what species will come in. Lots of snook. Um, there is a chart that will identify the many fish, but it's it's quite interesting considering this is fresh water. But fresh water is not mandatory for um, manatees. Um, survival because they can adapt to any kind of water. Um, however, they do need to drink fresh water, but um, they um, can live in brackish or salt water. The reason that they can uh, live in Florida is because these springs stay 72, 74 degrees all year round. Absolutely essential.